The camera pans to the right as a sea monster emerges from the water, grabs the blue boat, and then pulls it underneath until it's completely gone. Let's see what this does. Oh, whoa, Godzilla. <laughs> Whoa, okay, that's sick. Video editing has changed forever. Now with the power of VO3 and ChatGBT directly inside Premiere Pro, the possibilities are endless. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to generate images and videos without ever leaving your timeline with Chat Video Pro. I'm Tanis. I've been editing videos for over a decade and I have a production company here in Texas. And if there's one thing we've learned, we have to create videos that stand out and we gotta save time while we're doing it. That's why we created Chat Video Pro. It's combining the superpower of ChatGBT and Google BEO all inside your timeline. In this video walkthrough, I'm gonna be showing you the workflow on how you can instantly add Hollywood style visual effects and generate extend your clips, how to generate images and graphics right inside the timeline and how to animate them without ever touching keyframes. I'm also going to be going over our custom JSON prompter, which helps you dial in the perfect prompt to generate your videos. All of that inside Premiere Pro. Let's get into it. All right, so let's just get started with a basic image generation. Generate me an image of the earth on a transparent background. All right, so it's getting right to it. The images generate pretty fast. All right, awesome. It looks like our image came back and there it is, the earth on a transparent background. Here's the cool thing. You can just click this one button, choose where to save it, and it automatically imports right into your project. This is a killer feature for your workflow. Like no more leaving to go to ChatGPT to generate the graphic that you need. Or if you need a clip art of something, it just comes right into your timeline right here. Now, let me show you how these features interconnect together. If you scroll down, there's this new transform button underneath the image. And when you click that, you see generate as video. And when you click this, you can see a preview of the image you generated and you can give it a brief description on the type of animation that you're looking for. So let's just animate this earth. Let's say the earth spins. That's pretty basic, let's see what it does. So whenever you generate that, it now sends the image and the prompt to Google VO3 to start your video generation. All right, and here's our video, let's check it out. <laughs> awesome, this is exactly what we wanted, the earth spins. All right, and so here's another cool thing, same thing with the images. You can click download and instantly get it right inside your product. So now you can generate any element you ever need and you can animate that element all inside Premiere Pro. This is crazy. All right, now let's try an example about how you can take an existing graphic and animate it. So I have our Chat Video Pro logo here and I'd like to see if we can turn it into a 3D object where the camera flies through the play button. I think that'd be super cool. So first thing you wanna do is just click this camera button, which takes a screenshot of the current frame and attaches it to the chat. Let's turn on Google VEO. Make this logo a 3D object and have the camera fly through the play button and turn the background into space. Okay, let's see if it got this uh, 3D image right. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool. I was doubting it for a second, but that's pretty dope. Um, it's not exactly what I had imagined, but it's still super sick. All right, so the result wasn't exactly what I was going for, but that's because it really comes down to the way you prompt it. I just quickly told it what I wanted, but if I went into a little bit more detail, you'd get a much better result. So to fix that, we actually created a conversation starter right inside Chat Video Pro and it uses JSON prompting. And JSON prompting basically is a way for the machine to understand what you want in a lot more detail. So when you click this conversation starter, it's gonna ask you a few questions on what you're looking for. And I'm just gonna explain it the same way and see if we can get this to generate a better result for us. So I'm attaching the image of the logo again. All right, I wanna create a video where we turn this logo into a 3D object and the camera flies through the play button in the center and the environment becomes space. So I basically gave it the same like rudimentary prompt again, but the cool thing with this system is it's going to ask some follow-up questions to really confirm what you want, and then it's going to put it in the best format. So it's asking all the questions that it would need to know. Let's see. I want the logo to look like it's already floating around, so it sort of rotates left and right, and you can see that it's 
got dimension to it that it's 3D. Then the camera quickly flies through the play button and when it does that, the environment transforms into space and add some cool motion blur as well. So I gave it a little bit more information here and now it's going to create the prompt itself. So as you can see here, it created the JSON output, which makes it really easy to just copy right here, paste it in, let's turn on VO and let's give it the reference image one more time. So now it's gonna have the reference image with this awesome prompt and let's see if we get a better result this time. Excited. Excited to see. Okay, the video's in. Let's check it out and see if it's better than the first result. Oh. Oh, that's awesome. That's exactly what I was looking for. So I saw the 3D part. It got the motion blur right. It flew through the play button. So it really just comes down to the way you prompt it. That's why we included the JSON prompter conversation starter. I can't wait to see what the community comes up with this. And just imagine being able to generate a graphic for your video with ChatGPT inside Premiere Pro and then turn that into an animation. You're gonna blow your clients' minds. This is awesome. Imagine how much time it would save or if you didn't know how to do that, it basically levels up your creative ability. So it makes you stand out from the pack being able to create cool effects like this. Another really awesome thing that we added to Chat Video Pro now is the library. Now you can instantly find all of your generated images and videos right inside the panel here. You can sort it by what you're looking for it's got a cool preview. You can click to go to the chat that it was from or download it right there. And this is just a really cool way to organize your workflow and make sure that you can always find what you're looking for. Chat Video Pro was built by creators for creators. If you wanna elevate your workflow, pick up your copy today at chatvideopro.com. Now let's get back into it and see what else this thing can do. All right, another cool way to use this workflow is to instantly add VFX to your existing footage. So right here I have a really cool shot of this blue boat. And I think it would be awesome to add a VFX where a sea monster takes it and pulls it underwater. So let's just go ahead and do that. You click the screen capture button. Again, it automatically brings in that frame into Chat Video Pro. Make sure you turn on the VO button to generate as a video. And then let's tell it the prompt. The camera pans to the right as a sea monster emerges from the water, grabs the blue boat, and then pulls it underneath until it's completely gone. Let's see what this does. Oh, it said sea baster. So we'll see if it figures that one out. Probably should have said like tentacle monster or something, but like, yeah, this is where we're just vibe editing, we'll see what it makes. Another thing, whenever you're generating these effects, make sure you don't move the playhead because it's taking that reference image of where it got the screenshot, so you don't want it to do a jump cut. Okay, the video's ready. I'm super excited to see this one. Let's see what it does. Oh, whoa, Godzilla! <laughs> Whoa, okay, that's sick. Let's so let's download it and see if it all combines together. So again, downloading instantly comes into your timeline. Let's see it together. So nice, nice. <laughs> so that's crazy. I mean, imagine what it would take to do an, a crazy effect like that. So the fact that you could do it right inside Premiere Pro, like that was so quick, the workflow. Taking your source image and making Hollywood style VFX is game changer. Like, I don't know what it would have taken for me to make it edit like that, but the fact that I could do it in pretty much one prompt is insane. And all of it right inside Premiere Pro. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you found it helpful, drop a like and subscribe to see what else this thing can do. And if you wanna pick up your copy today, make sure to grab it for this limited time deal because you don't wanna miss out on the early adopter and you wanna stand out from the pack with this game-changing technology. Comment below how you'd use this in your workflow. And if you already own Chat Video Pro, let us know any features that you'd like to see because we're gonna to continue to update and make this thing better and we can't wait to see what the community does with these new features.